as he congratulated the new executive of the Trinidad and Tobago Medical Association, TTMA. Health Minister Terence Dialsing reminded the doctors that they would have to delve into the issue of medical marijuana sooner rather than later. How do we as a fraternity start the conversation amongst ourselves about the prescribing, the selection of appropriate patients, the training of doctors, the training of your a &E doctors. What syllabus are you going to look at in part of your continuing education program? Medical marijuana is here. Whether we like it or not, and quite frankly, I think the time has come for it. The minister also assured the doctors that their work doesn't go unnoticed as he lamented that doctors are often blamed for anything that goes wrong. Because it is fashionable to use the public health care system as a whipping boy in Trinidad and Tobago. But I will tell you from the bottom of my heart, I have your backs. I have your backs on this. Because I know the miracles that you perform every single day that largely goes unnoticed. The new incoming president of the TTMA, Dr. Darren Dukiram, said graduating from medical school now, as compared to 15 years ago, is vastly different with the support offered by the association to young professionals. And this makes the work that we do in the TNTMA even more relevant in the current context. I did not have the TNTMA when I was at that career path junction in high school but certainly I did after I graduated from medical school. I became involved in this great organization in 2007 after being invited by senior pharmacist and head of the Chamber of Commerce of Sangre Grande, Mr. Ricardo Mohammed. Thank you, Ricardo. Eight doctors and the new TTMA president took the oath on Saturday during the ceremony to maintain the honor and interests of the medical profession. Mahalia Joseph Horton, TTT News.